Hey, this is Lisa Allen, and I am super excited to show you my brand new YouTube research and competitive analysis video marketing software. It's called Tube Viper X, and as you can see, it's very clean, laid out so that it's easy to use. You've got an easy tab interface with the different features available to you. And so I'm just going to walk you through some of the features of the application. It's got way too many for me to go through everything in this video, but I'm going to give you the basics. So first of all, we've got four different tabs here. We've got the Video Analyzer tab, Channel Analyzer, the Advanced Rank Tracker, and the Keyword Analyzer tab. So on the Video Analyzer tab, this allows you to look up any keyword in YouTube and find out which videos are ranking for that keyword in YouTube search. And it gives you all the vital statistics of the individual videos. It lets you see exactly where their rankings are coming from. and lets you look at their titles and their URLs and especially their tags, which you'll be able to find over here in the tags column. So I'm just going to do a search really quickly so you can see what kind of data you get back. Just going to type in six pack abs here, which is a very popular keyword. So I'm just going to click on search and you see that I instantly get back the top 10. Now, if you want to go for more than 10 videos, you can actually get results on up to 100 videos, but I find that the top 10 is the most useful. So for this keyword, the top video is the six extreme six pack abs workout. And if you click here on the link, it will take you straight to the video on YouTube. It's got a little mini browser so you can watch the video from right within the app if you want to. You also see things like the page rank that tells you how much authority YouTube thinks or Google thinks that this video has. The number of views so you can see what's the most popular right now and over the long term, how many comments, so you can see what kind of interaction is with the video. You can also see the likes, the dislikes, the description. Now this here is description link it means is there a link in the description. Usually that means the video is monetized. And then of course you've got the published dates, the tags, the category is sometimes interesting because a lot of times you can get a video to rank a little bit higher if you put it in a slightly different category. And so seeing what categories other people have put theirs in can be helpful. But on the tags, there's a couple of interesting things that I wanted to show you. Now, as you know, a lot of times you can compete with a top video just simply by copying their tags. And so I've made it really easy for you to get the tags out. You, you can export the whole results as a CSV, but you don't have to to get to the tags. Just select an item, then right click and click Copy Video Tags. And this is what I get out and these are the tags for the top video for six pack abs and you can see that they are ready right away to paste right into your own videos tag you don't have to reformat anything they're comma separated so they'll paste right in and there's a couple of other features here on the video analyzer screen that I want to just mention really quickly there's an SEO view which gives you a little bit more in-depth information about the video. For instance, you've got the channel rank, so you can see how much authority the channel this video belongs to. It tells you whether the keyword is in the title or the description, how old in age it is, and you can see views and comments side by side. And sometimes if you can see this, you can pick out the videos where the person has actually run a bunch of fake views to it because they'll have hardly any comments. You can also see how many backlinks are running to that video so you can see how hard you're going to have to work if you wanted to bump this video out of the top slot. Now also in the pro version you can contact the owner of this video or comment on this video just by clicking these links here and it will pop up a mini browser and allow you to log into your YouTube account so you can contact or comment on the video. Now another really nice thing is that when you go over to Channel Analyzer, if you put in a username of a channel, you can see all the results from that particular channel. But say I see an interesting video over here and I want to check out the user's channel, like maybe I want to check out the BeFit channel, all I have to do is click on the link here. I don't need to retype it. And so it makes it really easy to just click on the link, hit search, and I've got all the intel on this competitor's channel and I can see what they're doing. I can get ideas for other kinds of content that maybe I might want to produce. 
I can see which of their content is the most popular, see how well they're doing, see what kind of page rankings they're getting, and of course, spy on their tags. Now I should also mention that in each of these views, if there is data here that you, maybe you want to filter out, you don't want to see, maybe you only want to see, let's say maybe I only wanted to see results that had the word yoga in them in the title. I can filter it by title, contains, and then I type in yoga. And <laughs> that would be why I removed everything because I misspelled it. So yoga. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, so all of these results have yoga in the title. And if I remove the filter, then I'm back to the original results. So it makes it really easy to really narrow your focus down onto just the information you want to look at at that moment. Now this is the advanced rank tracker. Basically all you need to do is put in the keyword that you want to track results for and the URL, the video watch URL that you want to be watching in the, the results. And the advanced keyword tracker will track for YouTube, so it will tell you what position that video is in YouTube. It will check the position in Google and in Yahoo. And you can see that it saves here a history of all the checks that I have made. And so on this particular video, I checked it on the 19th, the 24th, the 26th, the 28th, and I checked it again on August 2nd. So each of these columns are sortable, so if I want to sort by only a particular video, I can do that. I've made it really, really easy to follow these videos over time. Instead of having to type in the keyword again and copy and paste the URL again, you just click recheck. If I go down to the bottom here, you'll see the next time that it's been checked is right here. Now also if you want to look at these as a visual chart, and I feel this is a really nice feature that I think you're really going to love, particularly if you have clients that you need to show your progress to and uh, let them see just how well their videos are doing. And you just click on chart and you can see here that you've got a line chart showing all of the rankings and their change over time and it follows the YouTube, Google, and Yahoo on one chart. Now also another really nice thing about the chart is that you can export these results as a CSV if you want to suck this information into uh, maybe Excel and do some Excel charts you can do that or you can export the existing chart as a JPEG and so you can actually take the image and use it in your own reports that you give to your clients. Now the last tab is the Keyword Analyzer tab and this actually will help you brainstorm new ideas for your videos and determine which kinds of keywords you should be going after because you can determine using this where the money is in the niche. You can look at the CPC and see which keywords are really profitable. Now you can choose the number of results that you want. The more results that you choose, it will take slightly longer to complete the search because it does have to go through the pages. And so all you really need is that you need to have an AdWords account configured inside the account. So you just click here to go to the accounts and add it. And so you select your AdWords accounts from the drop down. You put in the C keyword that you want suggestions for. So I'm going to say six pack abs. Click on search and it will tell you down here where it is in the process. See now it's logged into our account and now it's collecting the results. Okay, so it's finished fetching our keywords and you can see that we've got 31 because that includes the actual seed keyword itself. And you've got the search volume. You can resort these and pick out the ones with the best search volume if you like. You can also sort on CPC and there is some additional information that it can go out and get from other sources that will tell you a little bit more about the competition for this particular keyword. And so all you have to do to get it to fetch that is just click on fill and it will go out and fetch the number of videos that are competing for this keyword. It will give you the x-ray which is how competitive this keyword is compared to how many searches there are. And then it will also grab the number of backlinks to the top video for this keyword and whether there's videos on page one. So in this case, it has a really, really low x-ray, which means it's really going to be hard to rank this particular keyword because it's very broad and very popular and there's a lot of competition for it. The top video only has 26 backlinks 
going to it and video on page one there are already three videos for this keyword appearing on page one and so that tells you that it will be hard to get another video on the page one of the Google SERPs because they already have pretty much as many as Google likes to put. Usually they like to put no more than two. Sometimes you'll find three if they have really a lot of video content for that. But generally you won't find more than that. And so that means that this particular keyword is going to be really, really difficult. And so maybe you might want to look for some of these others that are, have more long tail and go for those. Now just one last thing I wanted to show you really quickly and that is the onboard help system. You can just go right in here to the application and look at the help videos for any of the tabs and also the help videos can be updated by me at any time so if there's a question that comes up a lot and that we find a lot of users are asking it what we'll do is that we will just record a new video and we will add it to the training videos inside the application and that happens seamlessly you won't have to upgrade your application at all and the new videos will just show up here so very very useful now there are some other features that I could show you but as I said there's just way too much for me to go through absolutely everything so I think you're really gonna like this application it's very full featured it has everything that you would expect in YouTube research software and a few unexpected features that you're gonna find very very useful also I also wanted to mention about the support of this application I am not a person who does pump and dump software. You can look at my previous software and I have maintained them. There have been on my RSS Authority Sniper software, there have been no fewer than nine updates since I released it last year, including some new features. And so you can look forward to that kind of support for Tube Viper X also. So that's it for this video. I think you're really going to love the software and uh, run ahead and, and grab it. If you're into YouTube marketing, this will help you out a lot. Thanks for watching. Thank mm -hmm. you.